I created this video in just 5 minutes. You just have to enter an idea like this, and your video will be ready. Most importantly, this video is monetizable. In this video, I will share the exact method of making it. Let's dive in. To create the video, I'll be using an AI-powered tool called Motion AI. It's a storytelling and animation-making tool, a huge asset for animators. Now, they've introduced a new feature called Storyteller, which allows you to create monetizable videos from ideas. You'll find a variety of options to bring your creation to life. To start creating the video, select the Motion Storyteller tool and create an account. I'll put the link in the description. Once you're logged in, your interface will look like this. Here you'll find two options to create the video. The first one is to generate a video from an idea, and if you already have a story, you can use the second option. If you scroll down, you'll find some featured videos for inspiration. Alright, now let's start creating our own video. I'll go with the Generate From Prompt option. After arriving on this page, enter your idea into the box. I'm typing a prompt about a bedtime story of unicorns for kids. You can generate high-quality videos from simple prompts like this, but I suggest using a detailed prompt for better results. After entering the idea, set the aspect ratio of the video. You can create videos in landscape, portrait, or square mode. This time, I'll go with portrait mode. Next, set the video language. After that, select the tone of the video. Since we're generating a video for children, I'm choosing children. Next, we need to set the visual style of the video. You'll find several popular visual styles here. This time, I'll go with the retro comic style. Once everything is set, hit the generate button. Now Motion AI will take some time to generate the story and visuals. Let's fast forward this part. And here it is. The video is ready. You can see it has generated 18 scenes with proper narration text. For each scene, it has generated an image. After reviewing some scenes, I found that the images are highly related to the narration. But if you want to regenerate any image, simply click on the Regenerate button. Now you can customize the prompt to regenerate the image. You can even control the pose from here. In the Pose library, you will find a vast number of poses. You have to just select a pose and regenerate the image. I am skipping this time. I am just customizing the prompt. And this is our newly generated image. You can even upload your own assets by clicking the Use Asset button and uploading your image. Now for the narration part, if you want to make any changes, you can do so. Yes, the narration text is customizable. However, I think some scenes are very long, and it may sound boring because each narration will act as a scene. To make the video more engaging, we will split the scenes. At the top of every scene, you'll find some options. The first one is to split the scene. The second is to merge it with the previous scene, and the third is to merge it with the next scene. If you want to delete any scene, you can do that here as well. Alright, since I want to split the scene, I'm clicking here. You can see that Motion Storyteller split the scene and created two scenes from the first one. Now split all the scenes you need. If you want to create a new scene, just click on the plus icon after the scene, and a new scene will be added. Now, you might say, you showed us a video with animation, but there are no animated scenes. Don't worry. You can animate the image. Just click the Animate button, and now our image is animated. Here in the top of the storyboard, you will find the Animate All button to animate all the scenes in one click. Alright, now click the Next button to move forward. Okay, this is the editing page. Here, you can customize the title, subtitles, motion, translation, voiceover, and music. First, in the title section, you can add the title style. If you don't want a title, just use the None option. The same goes for subtitles. I'll select this style for the subtitles. Next, in the Thumbnail option, you can automatically create a thumbnail. The first option is an image with text, and the last two are text with a black or white background. Next, if you want to add effects to the scenes, you can choose from the effects here. I think the shake effect will work best for me. After the scene effects, you'll find the scene transitions option. Use one to make the transitions look perfect. Now, the most important part is the voiceover. You'll find a vast number of ultra-realistic voiceovers here. Some are only for paid users. The paid plan starts at $8, which gives you 1,000 credits, and the pro plan offers 5,000 credits for $32, along with other features. All right, click here to listen to the voices. After listening to some, choose the best one. Finally, you'll find AI music to use as background music. Choose a BGM that will engage your audience. Once everything is set, hit the Composite button. 
Now it will take some time to render our video. While you wait, you'll see that Mushin AI generates the title, summary, and hashtags for us. So, it's a complete content creation tool. You don't need any other tool to generate titles, tags, or descriptions. It even generates a thumbnail for us, which we'll review later. And here it is. Our video is ready. Let's take a look. Once upon a time, in a land far, far away, there was a magical kingdom called Lumina Valley. It was a wondrous place where flowers bloomed and all the colors of the rainbow, and the trees whispered secrets of the ages to anyone who would listen. The most enchanting creatures in Lumina Valley were the unicorns, majestic beings with shimmering coats and spiraling golden horns that glowed at night. Among all the unicorns, there was a young and curious one named Starlight. I think it's a really good video. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. If you want to download the video, click the download button. To download the thumbnail, click here. And this is our video thumbnail. It's really cool. Now, if you want to create more advanced videos using advanced tech, you can download the storyboard as well. Just click here to download it. Our storyboard has been downloaded. You can see all the scene images, and in this text file, you'll find the video script. That's amazing. All right. Now if you already have a script or story and want to make a video with it, go back to the home page or click the Generate New button. This time, choose the Use My Content option. On the next page, enter your full script in the box, set the aspect ratio and language, and choose your preferred style. After that, hit the Generate button. Just like before, review all the scenes and make changes if needed. Next, animate all the scenes to make the video captivating. On the next page, Customize all the settings as per your need, and then hit the composite button. And here it is, the video is ready. Ethan lived with his faithful dog, Shadow. Shadow had been by Ethan's side since he could remember. Honestly speaking, the video quality is good. Most importantly, Mushin AI guarantees monetization. So you can monetize the video and make money from YouTube, TikTok, or Instagram. This isn't the end. Mushin's animator tool is also amazing. It can generate incredible animations with consistent characters from a text prompt. I'll make another video about that in the future. You can invite your friends and get 100 credits, so don't forget to try this tool. Alright friends, I'll wrap up the video now. Before I go, I'd love to hear about your experience creating storyteller videos with AI. -I. Share your thoughts and results in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful, and subscribe to our channel for more amazing tutorials like this one. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, happy creating.